What's up guys? Shad Juice here. Doing a little yard sound today. There's actually a little bit going on today. It's uh, Saturday, October 12th, or 19th, my bad. <laughs> um, there's one sale listed that's got video games and Funko Pops. It starts at 9. I drove by there about quarter to 8. They didn't even have the, they were just putting tables out. I should have stayed there, but I drove away, of course, to go to another sale. So we're going to head back there now and just see what happens. I'm sure somebody else done went there by now. I should have known better, but we'll see what happens. Hopefully we find some stuff today. Let's go. Cool, huh? Yeah. Can you even use it for school? Yeah. Good morning. How are you? Morning. How are you doing? I have pencil
What's up, guys? Shad Juice here. It's uh, later in the weekend and Sunday night. Um, just decided to uh, show the pickups I got from the yard sales. It wasn't a great yard sale day. I mean, I had fun. Me and Mikey had fun. Um, probably went through about 15 sales. It was just not bad for, uh, you know, midway through October. And uh, show you what we got. Um, if you did see that sale that had all the beer signs, that was a, a a bar that was, I don't know if they were closing or they were just getting rid of a bunch of crap they had. But they had some, they had some cool beer signs. A lot of it was overpriced and none of it I really thought I could make any money on. They had a, had a cool Bengals neon sign, but the bottom part didn't work. They wanted 120 for it. So, I mean, I would have paid probably 80 to 100 bucks if it was fully working just to keep, but... But it was cool seeing some like new 10 signs and some mirrors that were brand new, never used, but I didn't really see nothing to make any money on there. The only thing I did buy, which really isn't worth much either, is this uh, Ricoton VHS uh, cassette rewinder. Um, it's still, it's never been used. It's still in the plastic, like brand new condition. It don't seem like they sell much, but I don't think there's one on there that was in this kind of condition. Maybe I can get 15 and 20 bucks for it. I paid $2 for it. Um, next picked up was that uh, they had some Reds bobbleheads, but they wanted like 10 bucks a piece. And I ain't paying 10 bucks for bobbleheads unless they're worth like at least $35 or so. 30, 35 bucks. That's just still high to pay at a yard sale. But they had this boxing glove. For five bucks. It's kind of uh, faded, but if you don't know who that is, that's Aaron Pryor. He's a lo like a local legend boxing here in Cincinnati. It says uh it's still Hawk time. Aaron Pryor, his name was the nickname was the Hawk. Um he held the uh light welterweight championship twice, I think. And I think his, uh, he had 40 fights, one loss, and uh, 35 knockouts, I'm pretty sure. So I just thought this was cool. He died a few years ago. So I thought this was cool to hang on to. The uh, marker looks kind of, kind of faded in it, but I still think that's a cool cool thing to have for five bucks. Like I said, he's a local guy, so I'm just going to hold on to it. I don't think there's big money in it anyways. Like I've seen uh, really good autographs. With the same inscription. Not going for a whole lot. but Like I said. That's just going to be a personal thing to keep. And let's get into that uh, yard sale. I said they had all the video game stuff. And Funko Pops. Well I finally got there. And they had opened. And uh, he had Funko Pops. And uh, he was going off the pop price guide. He had like a Hello Kitty classic. And he was talking like $70 for that. And I looked it up. And I was like. I could get it for like 15 bucks shipped to my door on eBay. And I told him that. And, you know, some people just go buy them guides like they're like they're the Holy, Holy Bible, man. That's, that's what you go by is the pop guides, which I don't go by. If, I want to see what it's selling for. Them guides don't mean nothing. Same with price charting. You can kind of get a general idea of what video games on there, but I'm going by eBay solds. That's all I'm going for. So, especially when I'm buying stuff. So... I didn't get no pops. He had a Xbox 360 and a bunch of games. None of them, they were all like dollar games. I didn't even feel like making an offer on it. But he did have this uh, 3DS. It's a little beat up, but it works good. And then he had this uh, rare lime, ge lime green uh, Nintendo DS Lite, which I just sold this with a, there's Wheel of Fortune in there. With the charger, I sold that for fifty five dollars ship. So that was a great deal. I paid twenty five bucks for all this. I paid twenty five bucks for the two, the three DS and the regular DS. Bunch of games, but most of them are just kids games. There was no uh, like standout titles. But there is this. I thought it was cool. Yard sale hidden treasures. That's a new one. Let's see, Zoo Tycoon 2, nothing great. Uh, there was a SpongeBob game. My kid took that one. Mikey took that one. So 
but like I said, 25 bucks. I'm gonna put this one up for probably 50 bucks at least. I think there's like a Wreck It Ralph game, yeah, right there for the 3DS. I'm gonna lot that with it and a couple DS games and the charger. Probably ask 50, 55 bucks for that too. So yeah, they're a $25 investment. I'm gonna net 100 bucks. So that's pretty cool. Also had this uh little case for it. I don't know. <laughs> it's just got some goofy buttons on there. So uh yeah, man, that's about it. Uh, Mikey got like a sleeve of Pokemon hologram cards. Most of them were newer ones. They were not really worth nothing. And he's in bed right now, so. Uh, I might just keep it at this. Have a short little video this week, or I might add a pickup I've had, a local pickup or something at the end. If not, this will wrap it up. I uh, appreciate you, all got, you guys all summer long checking out my yard sale videos. They've done pretty good. I was happy with all the people that liked watching them. So that was pretty cool. If you could, just hit that thumbs up, man. And get us in the search, searches a little more. I like interacting with you guys. So if you want to uh, leave a comment. And uh, if you ever want to check out my eBay store, it's in the description. So if you want to see what I'm selling... I'm going to get back into what's sold videos a little more now that uh, yard sales are wrapping up for the year. So hopefully there's something this uh, weekend to go to. So uh, appreciate you guys watching. Peace out.